Doctors' appointments may not be our favorite, but there are times when our bodies send us warning signs that would be unwise to disregard. Why is this the case? Well, our bodies are finely tuned to detect potential dangers and alert us accordingly. However, some symptoms of life-threatening conditions can be less obvious than others. For the sake of our well-being, let's uncover these subtler signs. Number 10. Damaged Nails Did you know that a lot of changes in our nails actually signal more serious issues? Our nails are smooth and have a coloring. That's normal if we're healthy. But if you see any abnormalities in your nails, then you should go and see a doctor. But what kind of abnormalities are we talking about? Well, you should look for discoloration changes in thickness and shape, as well as bleeding and swelling. The most serious condition your nails can point out is heart or lung disease. If there are lines spreading across your nails, you should know that they're called those lines and that they can point to conditions such as pneumonia. In this case, your next stop should be your pulmonologist. You should be heading to your cardiologist. If your nails are showing signs of clubbing, which is when the nail thickens and curves, this is one of the most common signs of cardiovascular diseases and should most definitely not be overlooked. Number 9. Sharp Pain on Your Side If all of a sudden you start feeling a sharp pain in the lower right region of your body, you should see your doctor straight away because it might be appendicitis, it may feel like someone's piercing your body. You may feel nauseated and perhaps even feverish. If you have reason to believe that your appendicitis is inflamed, you should definitely head out to the emergency room. They will then direct you to the gastroenterologist who can consult a general surgeon and perform an emergency surgery. It sounds scary, but it's nothing compared to the damage a burst appendicitis can do if it burst. It releases toxins into your body, which can cause sepsis, a potentially life-threatening condition as your organs may start failing. Best of all, if you catch it early enough, you may be able to treat it with antibiotics. So if you're having doubts, don't think twice and have someone drive you to the nearest hospital. A false alarm will be the least of your concerns and no one will blame you if you're being too cautious. Number eight, itching. You might not be aware, but itching is a sign of diabetes. The sensation occurs when nerve fibers found in the outer layers of skin have been damaged. The damage is caused by high levels of glucose in the blood, which is called diabetic polyneuropathy. In addition to this, there are various other diabetes-related issues that can cause itching, such as liver failure or allergic reactions to medications. But YouTube video, we all get itches from time to time. So how do we know when to visit the doctor? First, you should know that this kind of itching appears anywhere on your body and it can be so severe that you won't be able to sleep. So, if you feel very uncomfortable in your clothes and cannot function normally, you should most certainly see your dermatologist. But don't worry, because diabetes-related itching can be cured if you manage your diet carefully. Avoid very hot bath and apply lotion to keep your skin moisturized. And if you're diagnosed with diabetes, your next stop should be your endocrinologist who will provide you with all the necessary information. Number seven, flashes of light. Have you recently started experiencing short, bright flashes of light? The more entertaining answer would be that someone around you is doing magic, but I doubt that's the case. The explanation might be less entertaining, but more realistic and definitely a cause to go see your ophthalmologist if you have one. If you're experiencing bright spots, short blinding flashes, or any other visual disturbance, it's possible that your retina has been damaged. If your retina has detached, it requires immediate medical attention before you have to deal with issues such as permanent vision loss. The bright side is that this can be dealt with easily without any permanent damage. If you go see your doctor in time, it's also possible that your vision gets slightly worse and that you'll need glasses or contact lenses. If none of the mentioned diagnosis fits you, it's possible that the flashes are only warning signs that you might be having a migraine soon. If that is the case, you should pay a visit to a headache or migraine specialist who can help you deal with this. Number six, sudden confusion. One of the most serious medical conditions you can experience is a brain tumor or bleeding in the brain. This can manifest through very ordinary symptoms that are easy to overlook, such as sudden confusion if you're becoming confused without any reasonable explanation 
or if you're showing an inability to concentrate. This may be the reason why. In addition to this, there are other symptoms just as easily overlooked, such as changes in personality, sudden bursts, or erratic behavior, or impulsive decision-making. If this kind of behavior isn't already a part of your character, your brain might be signaling to you in any way it can that something is wrong. The faster you act, the better even if all of these symptoms aren't caused by the brain tumor, they can point to other serious conditions, such as a stroke. If you're in doubt, head to see your neurologist because in cases like these, it is better to be safe than sorry and prevent a more serious and complicated intervention by being cautious. Number 5. Swollen Legs If you work long hours while being on your feet, you're probably subjected to constant swelling in the legs. But the truth is that this without a proper cause can point out a more serious condition than you initially thought. If there's accumulated fluid called edema in your extremities without probable cause, and if it's very persistent, it's time to go see a doctor. It can be a symptom of various serious conditions, the most severe being heart failure. This happens because when blood and other fluids block your circulation, the heart is forced into overtime, which becomes damaging over time. If after seeing a cardiologist, you're sure that the heart is not the issue, it might be your hormones, especially thyroid hormones, and you should go and see your endocrinologist. Similar to this situation, Swollen toes can also indicate a serious condition such as psoriatic arthritis. Don't ignore these warning signs your body is sending you because prevention is still the best therapy. Number 4. Teeth Damage There's nothing worse than having a toothache, but if your teeth are damaged more than they should be, you might be looking at a more serious condition. Teeth damage can indicate that you're dealing with heartburn or even cancer. This happens because of acid reflux from struggling internal organs. If you don't see a gastrointestinal specialist and don't get this treated, it can even lead to oesophageal cancer. And if you're dealing with one particular throbbing tooth, the situation is not as serious, but equally as painful because you're probably dealing with nerve damage. The intervention isn't expensive or painless, but the longer you wait, the worse it will be. I know it doesn't seem like it, but there are far worse things than going to the dentist. Number 3. Irregular Bladder or Bowel Movements Sometimes the signs the body is sending us are way too subtle for us to notice, and that leads to some cancers being detected way too late. In this case, the symptom I'm referring to are changes in bowel or bladder movements. Yes, of course they can be caused by infections, certain foods, or even allergies, but they can also show us that our body is dealing with something more serious. It's precisely because we don't think much of them that severe conditions can go undetected for years without being noticed. If you notice a change that doesn't go away with herbal teas, soups, and other fluids, you should waste no time going to your urologist or specialist. Sometimes fear prevents us from paying a visit to our nearest health institution, but the consequences are far too great to be overlooked if you're facing a similar dilemma. Don't wait for the symptoms to be too serious to be manageable. Number 2. Purple Knuckles Another warning sign your body may send you that can be easily overlooked is slightly discolored or purple knuckles. Knuckles that show changing color, swelling, or any sort of abnormality can be a sign of dermatitis. This condition is an inflammation of the muscle tissue right underneath the skin of our knuckles and is caused by a lack of collagen. It represents itself as swelling and discoloration, but the issue lies in the fact that this autoimmune condition can be a warning sign for a variety of cancers that attack our internal organs, lungs, pancreas, or ovaries. This is why even mild symptoms like this one should not be overlooked, no matter how busy our lives get. Number 1. Thinning Hair Women tend to spend a lot of time worrying about their hair, the way it's done, the length, the color, but following the newest trends and styles isn't all that important. Paying slightly more attention to our hair, however, can actually save our lives. If your hair ever gets thinner without any logical explanation or external factor, you might be dealing with a more serious issue. This may signal an autoimmune disease such as thyroid disease before the situation escalates. You should pay a visit to your gynecologist 
as well as an endocrinologist to determine exactly what the issue is and how to properly treat it. In addition to this, diminishing hair can also point out to other issues that are related to nutritional deficiency, especially lack of vitamins B and D. And even though you can always take vitamins to improve your health, actually eating healthy foods that are naturally packed with vitamins is the best and the fastest way to improve your health. Did you find this list helpful? I hope you managed to take care of yourself and your body. Also, if you recognize yourself with any of these symptoms, don't hesitate to pay a visit to your doctor. Finally, if there's anything I missed, make sure to let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.